Myanmar's ousted ruling party chief Shui Man met Nobel laureate Aung San Suukyi on Monday as the country's political leaders maneuvered ahead of a showdown in parliament days after he was sacked by President Thien Sen. The president removed Shui Man and his allies from the leadership of the Union Solidarity and Development Party, USDP, last week in a dramatic shakeup of the country's political establishment three months before the first free general election in 25 years. SUUKYI, who leads the opposition National League for Democracy, NLD, that is expected to win the vote in November, and Shui Man met for an hour, a ruling party parliamentarian said on condition of anonymity. He said he did not know what they discussed. Shui Man's relationship with SUUKYI was regarded with suspicion among some members of the USDP, made up mostly of former military officers, and was one of the motives for his sacking. He antagonized the military by backing her campaign to change the constitution, which grants Myanmar's general sweeping political power. Shui Man's political future hangs in the balance after his rivalry with President Thien Sen came to a head on Wednesday, when trucks with security personnel sealed off the headquarters of the party. The president's allies hosted late-night meetings at the guarded USDP complex and purged Shui Man's faction from the party's executive committee. The next act in the drama will play out on Tuesday, when Shui Man will face the emboldened presidential faction of his own party as the chamber reopens for the last session before the November 8 vote. He remains a USDP party member and still holds the powerful position of Speaker of Parliament, but is under pressure to table a vote on a bill that could see him impeached. If approved, lawmakers would lose their seats if 1% of constituents sign a petition to recall them and the Election Commission finds the complaint is justified. Shui Man faces such a petition from his own constituents for his support in June of bills to amend the Constitution and limit the military's role in politics. It is unclear how much support the impeachment bill has in Parliament, where Shui Man has cultivated a reputation as a statesman since taking up the role of Speaker in 2011 when the ruling junta ceded power to a quasi-civilian government. The vote could be the first test of how much support Shui Man still has in Parliament. We have a plan to protect and cover him, said a lower house USDP member of parliament and supporter of Shui Man. We are watching their moves. Thien Sen made a rare appearance at the ruling party headquarters on Monday as his newly installed leadership met to prepare their strategy for the parliament session. Members of the USDP made an appeal for unity at the meeting. The USDP needs to stay strong, the new chairman of the party, Hde Oo said in a speech. Not only do we need to build a strong and united force to achieve our goals, but we also need to work together with allied political forces to win the 2015 election. Shui Man has said little publicly since his sacking. In a Facebook post on Saturday, he said he would do nothing to endanger the country or the people, and that neither should anybody else.